Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the Farming Pastor's Wife. This is not the original video I had planned for today. Um, I'm going to save today's video and upload it tomorrow, so you'll get a bonus video tomorrow. Normally, I don't upload on Wednesday, but you'll get the video that was meant for today, tomorrow. But I wanted to come on here and um, discuss two things real quick. My heart is really heavy. And you guys all tell me how much um, we're like family, and I agree. Um, you have become my family. And there are YouTubers that I watch that I don't know, um, and I've never met in person, but because I watch them, I feel a part of their family, I feel a part of who they are. And some of you know that I watch The Needy Homesteader. And I'm just asking all of my subscribers, to please say some special prayers for her. Several of you already know. In fact, it was one of you that let me know um, she had uploaded a video. And um, her husband and her and her children were on a pre-Valentine's dinner and was hit by a drunk driver. Her husband was killed instantly. She was critically injured and her children's sustained some severe injuries as well and she is now dealing with life and I can't I can't even imagine being in her shoes um, I know when I was sick when I uh, was in the hospital when I almost died I had Bryant at my side through everything and not only is she recovering from severe severe injuries but she doesn't have her best friend and she doesn't have her cheerleader beside her and so my heart is just broken for her this morning I've never met her in person I just am a part I watch her on YouTube and I am just asking that you guys say a special prayer for her um, and I appreciate it so much because we all have become family the youtubers kind of are a family um, because we go through the same thing and um, as far as YouTube goes and so I'm just asking that you guys pray for her and the second thing which is on a much lighter note um, this morning I sent out a post to my subscribers and if you're one of my subscribers you probably saw that post on YouTube if not it's there you can go look go look under the community tab and it's there um, I, I woke up this morning to a nasty comment that I never saw I did not see it and I just want y'all have come to my defense and said, oh, you're beautiful. Don't worry about the nasty comments and don't worry about what people say. They need Jesus and you are so right. And when I did the post, it wasn't so much the comment that I was concerned about. What my concern was, was in my husband's sweet way of trying to protect me and shield me from the comment, he accidentally deleted one of my defenders who had who had come, not, he, he just corrected me, he didn't delete them, he blocked them, and so, and deleted the comment, and um, so, I hope we've rectified it, I went in, and, and we googled how to fix it, and we tried to fix it, and I just wanted to put it out there, that if by chance, you are one of my faithful subscribers, and uh, you defended me on a comment, and if by chance, you're not allowed to leave a comment anymore, please reach out to me, via email or Facebook and let me know because I want to get that rectified. Uh, he was trying to block the person who left the nasty comment. It was a comment about my weight. <laughs> That's all he would tell me that it was a comment that all I know is they called me fat and I had a double chin. We all, I love my double chin <laughs> and he loves my double chin. So no, but, um, I just wanted to let you know that our, my concern was not necessarily the comment. My concern was getting the right person put back on my YouTube because uh, the last person I would want to delete is um, somebody who defended me. <laughs> and uh, he keeps correcting me. Block. Not delete. Sorry. But um, anyway, I just appreciate all your sweet words. And um, I, I learned long time ago to consider the source. Well, I don't know the source of that comment. I don't know this person, but their comment tells me all I need to know. <laughs> and um, it's one thing to be pretty on the outside, 
but if you don't have a kind and gentle heart, it's not worth much. Not worth much. So, anyway, I just wanted to thank you guys so much for supporting me and um, and encouraging me. And I wanted to let you know I wasn't whining about the comment. <laughs> I'm going to get those comments, and that's fine. Um, I mean, people are entitled to their opinion, I guess, but I don't have to leave it on my channel. And that's what um, he was doing, was trying to hide the person from my channel. And he accidentally hit the wrong one. But I think we fixed it, so... Anyway, this is just a quick video. Um, I don't know if I'll put this one out today or tomorrow. I don't know. Anyway, um, I just want you guys to know how much I love and appreciate you all. And you guys are wonderful. Whether I'm fat, skinny, square, round, rectangular, I, you know, it doesn't matter. I just love you guys. And um, so, y'all have a great day. Please remember the, the needy homesteader uh, in your prayers. Um, her post... Her video post was entitled, The Hardest Video I'll Ever Have to Make. And I just cannot imagine. I have cried all morning, and I just can't imagine. So, you guys remember her and lift her up. And I will see you guys tomorrow, because you're going to get today's video tomorrow. And so, it'll be a bonus video. So, this is a little short freebie for you. Y'all have a great day. Thank you for watching The Farm and Pastor's Wife. And remember, if the grease is hot enough, you can fry anything. Bye, y'all.